speaking of Glendale, oh, by the way, the team that resides there now, the Arizona Cardinals, and that is where, hi, Ian, hi, Tom, Super Bowl 57 will be played. That team just made a trade. We kind of knew Robbie Anderson was going somewhere after yesterday, Ian. Sources say Robbie Anderson, the now former Carolina Panthers receiver, is headed to the Arizona Cardinals, a deal just struck in the last couple minutes, and you mentioned it. Robbie Anderson has been shopped by the Panthers really over the course of the last couple of weeks. It seems like he was on the same page uh, with that as well. So all parties were kind of moving forward, knowing that this was not going to be a long-term thing. And after the sideline dispute yesterday that saw Steve Wilkes, the interim head coach, send Robbie Anderson to the locker room, today was the day it ended up happening. The Arizona Cardinals, who uh, also have an injury now, potential injury to Hollywood Brown and uh, also get DeAndre Hopkins back this week, by the way, Tom. Uh, they have now acquired another receiver, another weapon for quarterback Kyler Murray. And the Cardinals are sitting there right now, Ian, at 2-4. and four. They are 0-3 at home and searching for answers, particularly now that Hollywood Brown is banged up with a foot injury. Really, for the Panthers, they were looking to move on from Robbie Anderson as soon as they fired Coach Matt Rule a week ago. Anderson was one of the guys that Rule really wanted on the team. They go back to their days to, at Temple together once Rule was out as part of the shift that we've seen here in terms of interim coach Steve Wilkes also missing some of the assistants who are very close to Matt Rule. Anderson was another one they wanted to move on from even before what happened on the sideline yesterday. Also worth noting here, the Cardinals only take on about $690,000 in base salary. That's the prorated portion of Anderson's minimum base salary for the rest of the season because the Panthers converted about $11.7 million into a signing bonus earlier this year. So there's obviously a dead cap that the Panthers have to deal with here, but it's a player that they were going to move on from. For Arizona, they hope adding that dose of speed at the same time that they hope DeAndre Hopkins is going to be back in rage roll sooner than later is something big for them. Remember, Thursday night game this week, so not a lot of time to get Hopkins or Anderson ready to play in this one.